One of the great privileges in my life is to advocate for orphan and abandoned children around the world. And I'm coming to you on their behalf because we need your help. So many of you faithfully give, and I'm asking you to give again, this time with your hands and with your time. In our global ministry, do you want to know what the single biggest expense is every single month? Food. We help meet this need in two ways. One, we send them money so they can go to the local market and buy rice and beans and vegetables just to help feed kids two square meals a day. But we also supplement. We have a faithful ministry partner who for the last 10 years has been giving this to children in our local church partners care. This is a dietary supplement called a Mana Pack. This food is loaded with vitamins and minerals and 12 grams of protein. And it's been instrumental in changing the lives of children around the world. All of this food is packed by volunteers. And over the last decade, we have taken thousands, hundreds of thousands of meals out of the till to help the children that we serve. Well, we're gonna to come together as a community to put some back in. On Saturday, May 13th, the day before Mother's Day, we're gonna host our first annual Go Feed event right here in Kansas City. We're trying to pull together 500 volunteers to come to a warehouse where we're gonna provide all of the ingredients to pack this food. And if your hands are the last ones to touch one of these bags, I want you to know that the next hands that will touch them to open them will be those of a care provider to feed a child. If you're a local church, come. If you're a small group, come. Bring your coworkers, bring your children, bring your small business. In addition to volunteers, we need station sponsors. The cost of a station sponsorship is $1,000. It will cover 15 volunteers at that station and 3,000 meals that will be packed by that station. This is truly a community event to do something that will make a tangible difference to orphan and vulnerable children around the world.